Worthington. I didn't mean just that table, I mean all the y'all <laughs> and that table. And come on, let's show me some love, <laughs> That guy back there is looking right at me. I'm not clapping for your ass. You, you can't make me. Obama my ass. <laughs> he just looked at me and said I'm not gonna clap. <laughs> oh my God. Oh, uh, folks, uh, welcome here to the Ski Lodge. <laughs> I love the way y'all made me feel real comfortable when I drive up, I hear uh, country music playing and you might be a redneck on the damn Y'all <laughs> yeah, just wanted me to fit right the hell in, didn't you? <laughs> Thanks for going out of your way. I'm like walking in here, I'm like, you might be a redneck. God damn, man. Are you trying to send me a message? I was talking to the dude in the back. I said, you know, we might need to get some people in there. I'll go stand out by the road. He said, you might need a vest for that. I'm like, what? Is this a trap? What's up? Getting back for OJ with that? The hell? Oh my goodness. Uh, folks, I am the affirmative action portion of the show. Uh, they had to hire me. They had no choice. They didn't have no damn choice. So. You may be a black neck. So, uh, <laughs> I see one dude in the back. You, what's up, brother? I guess they try to wean y'all. Like We'll start him off in the back of the room. Then eventually let him sit in the middle. What's up, brother? <laughs> you get lost with them? <laughs> you get lost one day? I guess I'll just stay. <laughs> wow. Good to be up here in, uh, what is it, Allegheny? New, 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 new. Huh? Yeah. yeah that's that's well, just make sure I don't want to say your name or I'll give you another reason to hate me. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding, folks. This is a good, this is a good drive. It took me six hours to get up here. Six hours. That's a long drive. And I'm glad I came, folks. You, you look like a great audience. Look at it. Yeah, give yourself a hand, folks. He's still not clapping. He's not going to clap. I even tried to compliment, you know, on the side, you guys, hoping he would clap. I am not clapping for your ass. <laughs> You want to come tickle me, mother. <laughs> I'm not laughing at you. My good. Man, I had a long day yesterday. I'm still tired from my doctor's appointment. I was at the doctor's office for six hours yesterday. Didn't get to see the doctor either after six hours. Then the nurse had the nerve to come out and ask me for a urine sample, a semen sample, and a stool sample. <laughs> after six hours. I said, I gotta go, I got shit to do. <laughs> I gotta get up to Allegheny. I told her, you know what, take my underwear, everything you need. <laughs> That's how I'm gonna do my checkups from now on. Yeah, drop the drawers off, there you go. Got shit to do, got shit to do. I'm busy. Drove up here from New York. This is a good idea. Look at her over there. <laughs> Drove up here from New York, folks, man. I tell you, man, it's good to be up here and driving in New York City. New York got the worst drivers in the world. Any y'all ever drive to New York City? Oh my God. Only this happens in New York. Somebody cuts you off in traffic, and the person that cut you off gives you the finger on the way by. <laughs> You're driving, you can't figure out what the hell did I do? Shut the fuck up. <laughs> New York is a road. <laughs> and you ever have you ever cut somebody off and they follow you? Scare the shit out of you? I'm like, oh my god, he's still behind me. Oh my god. I cut him off in Manhattan. We're in Allegheny now. What the <laughs> Let me pull into the firehouse. <laughs> I hear the guys in that creek are really helpful. <laughs> There's one guy that won't clap for you. He probably won't help you either. <laughs> <laughs> oh, 
my God. New Yorkers are rude, though, man. I was on an elevator one time in Manhattan. Full elevator, all right? We saw that obese person coming. What did the New Yorkers do? Look at the weight capacity sign. Oh, hell no, you ain't getting on here. <laughs> I'm going to die because you can't put down a Big Mac? The hell no! Take the stand! What's wrong with you? Over capacity. I saw an old lady getting on the elevator, man. She had a walker. Old lady was like, hold the door! I held the door. You know what I mean. She got on push two. Got off on the second floor. What the New Yorkers say? Oh, she could have walked one damn flight. <laughs> she just selfish. She just selfish. Lazy ass. Look at her. The walker had wheels on it too. She could have made it. I saw an old lady with a walker the other day that had hand brakes on it. How fast do these people go that they need a stopping device? Does this ever happen? I almost ran people over. Good thing I put these hand brakes on here. Almost got to three miles an hour. Just stop walking, Grandma. What's wrong with you? Homeless people in New York City, man. I feel good. I helped a homeless guy out the other day. But they say you shouldn't give homeless people money because they're just going to buy crack or alcohol with it. All right? So I'm smart. I didn't give the guy money. I gave him crack and alcohol. <laughs> There you go, man. Smoke that up. You need to forget your problem. Okay, wash it down with the alcohol. Wash it down with the alcohol. See, you don't even remember you're homeless now, do you? You don't remember. See, I, I solved your problem. I solved your problem.